Hello, I'm John Rinaldi from Real Time Automation. I'm here in the RTA Gardens today to talk to you about time sensitive networking. Because frankly, I don't get it. I don't understand why there's such a big effort being put into that. I don't understand why there's so much money being spent on it. And I think it's probably kind of silly. So let me tell you why I think that. See if you agree with me. So the first thing is, what is, what is time sensitive networking? Time sensitive networking is designed to accomplish determinism over standard Ethernet. Why do we need determinism? Well, certain, certain applications, we need messages to arrive at devices and in a very precise time frame. They need to be there at that time, every time. And now we've got different ways that we use to do that now. We've got Circos, we've got Profinet IRT, we've got SIP Motion. We've got a number of different ways that we use to accomplish that. But the purpose of TSN is to make that happen in, over standard Ethernet. So the way it's supposed to work is a device would ask a director for bandwidth. Say, okay, I'm going to need to talk to this device every one millisecond. And another device would say, I'm going to need to talk to that robot every five milliseconds, whatever it is. So the director gets all of these requests and it figures out how the messages need to move through the network and what each of the, each switch and each router needs to do in terms of reserving bandwidth for those messages. And then they get it downloaded with those instructions and then the network takes off and runs. So it's a very complicated, it's a very difficult problem to solve because you've got all these different ways that a message could move through the network and all these competing requests. So it's actually a very, very interesting problem. So what, where's, what's the situation? Why do I have a problem with this? Well, number one, it's a very small minority of applications that really need this kind of uh, synchronization. Not every, very, I, I don't know what the numbers would be, but, not, but very few of them really need to have that kind of precision. Most things get by, because we're dealing with mechanical stuff, they get by with very sloppy kinds of precision. Secondly, who's making this director? Where's this director come from? I have yet to see anybody tell me, I've never seen, I haven't seen a, a prototype of that director uh, anywhere. Is Cisco making it? Is Microsoft making it? I don't know. That director seems to be kind of ephemeral and let's, if, it, if there's no director, there's no TSN. What I do see is people setting up sample systems at different trade shows and saying, hey, look, TSN. And 